Hola amigos. Hello, hello. It's Tracy and I'm coming to you from my channel, Tracy at the Mermaid Cove. I look a hot mess. It was beautiful here today in Maryland. I mean, hot, like weird hot. I'm sorry. I'm going to say that. I love the sun, but it's too hot. It's weird. Anyways, out gardening, picking up hate. I try to tell myself I love it, but I really, I hate it. No, who, who thinks this is fun? I don't know. But anyway, I had to cut down the bushes and trees and now I'm trying to get rid of all the stuff and drag it in this big plastic thing to my friend's house who has a bunch of trees and a bunch of property and I'm just going to put it there. Yeah, I only got one. I probably have two more to do. But anyway, I got it started. Okay, so I'm here with Trader Joe's. Yay, 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 yay. I, I just, you know, today it was great. I had like a one minute wait. I didn't feel too crowded. Um... But you know, changes are, are coming. So we're gonna see. I don't know, I'm not one, well, I'm waiting in line for 25 minutes to go into a store. I don't have to. So we'll see about my Trader Joe's, if it ends up being a problem. But anyway, for now it wasn't, so I got some good stuff. So I'm gonna start with, they had them today, the Turkey Gobbler whoop, 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 Wrap. Okay. So these are roast turkey, bleh, roast turkey stuffing, cranberry relish, and um, cheese I can't pronounce, neftotel, wrapped in a whole wheat tortilla. Okay, so I'm going to go over this with you. I think they're like $3.99. Whole wheat, not my favorite, but okay. So this is what it looks like. Can you see it? Like a hot mess. So there's turkey, there's the um, cranberry, there's stuffing, and then there's this cheese. Now this one's pretty good. Sometimes the cheese is at one end, you take a bite, and it's like, you get all the cheese in one bite. But I will say this, that I doctor it up a little bit. Um, I have, Trader Joe's has this really, really good cranberry sauce. I meant to, I think I got some today. Um, and I add some of that to it. Sometimes with a little mayo, but um, yeah, I love them. They're my go-to now. Um, they only have these seasonally, and everyone's loving them, so they haven't been there. They had two, and I bought them both. And also, I thought this was <laughs> the wrap, but this is Italian-style wrap, right? And smoked ham, salami, provolone cheese, and a creamy Dijon mustard on a whole wheat. So, um, I don't usually eat Italian sandwiches. I don't know. It looks kind of gross, actually. I'm not gonna sh I mean, it's just gross looking. Um, and the lettuce. Sometimes, I don't know. It's better to be eating earlier because the lettuce gets weird. I don't think they should put lettuce and get add your own. Just my warning to you. Eat ones with lettuce sooner rather than later. Okay. Have some friends coming over. We're going to do some taste tests. Actually, this one I'm going to send to my friend Mimi. So good. Peruvian potato chips. Now, I don't eat bags of potato chips. I, I right now probably have one open and eat it. I finish a bag. So I'm not getting them anymore, but they are, look how cute is that Aztec? And they're beautiful purple, nice and thick. The... Okay, now I got these last year. I don't think I liked them. Trader Joe's stuffing, Thanksgiving stuffing seasoned kettle chips. Flavors of classic holiday dish in each potato chip. But I know my friends are gonna wanna try it. I also got the movie popcorn, but I left it in my car. I ate it on my way home. So that's going to be my hard food right now. Anyway, you know, it looks like a potato chip. These kettle. Whoops, says no. Classic. Good till April next year. Smells okay. You know? Um. They're not bad. They're not my thing. I'm going to say that. I think there's a little too much sage. And I'm not a sage person. A little bit goes a long way. So I would never buy these again for me, but my friends to try, I'm gonna do. Um, let's, let's try this, let's wash that down. So this is new, they had the black tea sparkling watermelon. So this is sparkling honey crisp apple juice beverage. Oh, isn't that just, Packaging is so cute. Apparently, according to Katie Hespi, which everyone should watch her channel, um, you can just buy one. You don't have to buy the whole four thing. That feels weird though. Open it and take in one. 
Then maybe I'll do that when I'm doing taste. Oh, okay. It's been a day. I just spilled all my grapes all over the floor. And um, now this exploded and that's gonna be nice. And I guess I was shaking it. I didn't feel like I was anyway. That's good. That's the best one yet. And it's not even cold. Oh my God, this is gonna be so good cold. So it's 100 calories. That's why it's good. It's got sugar. Mmm. Yum. Absolutely be getting some more of those. That is yummy. Okay. Advent calendars are here. And I got one cat one for my friend's cat. They're five ninety nine. Ninety nine cents. So this one is the family holiday advent calendar twenty twenty. So you got your dog, you got your aunt. That would be me right here, the fun aunt. And all kinds of people. Um, 24 days of milk chocolate. So, you know, it's not good, really. I don't know. It's got all kinds of fun things you can cut out. And I might do that. But I like to have one. And so, yeah. It's just a, I'm trying to be excited about Christmas. Are you trying to be excited? Because, you know, maybe it can be more about what it should be about. Right? It's probably what it should be. Okay. Love this Stilton. It's a white Stilton with cranberries. And it's $9.99 a pound. This was $6.19. Love this stuff. Oh my God. Actually, I might put a little in my turkey gobbler. This is good. Um, Wegmans. If you have a Wegmans, they have the best cheese department. And I don't go there. My mom loved that place. So I tend, it's not on my beaten track. So I tend not to go there. Um, but they have a white Stilton with cranberries. Oh my God, it's so good. One time they didn't have any and the man went and got the big thing and cut it for me because I was very unhappy. So anyway, this isn't for some reason as good, but it's good. If you like your white Stilton, no, I don't like a stinky cheese. This is just perfect for me. Blue cheese, nope, nope, not happening. Okay, and I got sparkling cranberry flavored for tomorrow for my friends. The little cranberry. All their ones are good. Like that. What else do I have? Okay, so I didn't try this last time. Mozzarella, roast turkey breast, butternut squash, cranberries, and kale, and a flour tortilla. So it's called a gobbler quesadilla. I think it was $2.99. Anyway, put a little good cranberries on top. That's a nice, easy meal for me. Okay, so let me... Let me entertain you. Let me make you smile. Yeah, I know. I sing anyway. Okay, so I got this last time. Cedar Lane, authentic Mexican style, chicken and chili tamales. So good. You get four, ate every one for breakfast. One is um, like 290 calories. Add a little bit of salsa and sour cream mixed together. It's a perfect breakfast for me. And it fills me up and... You know, I went to school in Arizona. People would sell their food on, I mean, just come into where you were. Oh God, this is really good. But of course, did they have that one? No, no, they didn't. So I'm gonna try the pulled pork with red sauce. So that's a gamble. Sometimes I don't like the red sauce, but um, it's just 270. Anyway, I'm gonna try it. And I got the chili cheese tamales. So they're all about the same. Anyway, this is my new breakfast. I can clear out some of my refrigerator, my freezer. Tomorrow we're, um, my friends and I are gonna eat Trader Joe's stuff out of my freezer for taste tests and to eat food instead of making. And we're gonna, my friend's gonna teach me how to make a cheesecake in my Instapot. I'm gonna try to film that. So we'll see. And the big thing I got that we're gonna make tomorrow is the turkey stuffing and croot. So turkey tenderloin wrapped in cornbread stuffing and puff pastry. Now, the reason I could buy this is because it needs to sit in my fridge for 24 hours and they're coming tomorrow because this would not fit in my freezer. Hopefully after tomorrow it will. So you get gravy and cranberry sauce packets. So I'm very excited. It was $12.99, I think, which really, you know, we're only gonna try a little bit and then I'll be eating off that this week. Got lots of good stuff to eat. 
Um, let's see. So I got this for my friend, the Chantilly cream and a vanilla bean and a da 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 da. When you're gonna chill and you walk and you talk. I know people don't quit your day job. Too good. Get it, try it, you'll love it, and then you'll go get it and it won't be there. So they had one. I wonder how it freeze. Oh no. Okay, Christmas Palooza. Okay, Thanksgiving is just like gone. I mean, they have all the basic stuff. But, so I didn't try these last year. Trader Joe's Dark Chocolate Covered Peppermint Joe's. So I'm gonna do this, I am. Um, wow. That's a nice little gift, I think. Get a little gift thing. I don't know who I'm even for doing gifts, what's going on, but anyway. Hmm. Do you like peppermint? I do. That's a good cookie. Let me see. Mm mm mm. That is good. One cookie, you get 10, 140 calories. Holy gamoli. You better make sure that's the only thing you have. But that's really good. Peppermint is awesome. Just saying, I'm here to try for you. Not about me, it's about you. Okay. Did I? Yes, I did. They still have these. These are so good. My mini me's coming tomorrow. She's going to have some of these. They're so good. My friend Beverly, she's gonna get some too. Okay. Why I continue to buy cards, I don't know, but I do. I have to tell you the weirdest thing. So they have roses. I saw they're like $6.99. Beautiful dozen roses, right? Because I found the best ones that were this mauve pink. Gorgeous. And my mom loved flowers. So I get them occasionally just for her. Had them in my cart. You know, you pull your cart up. I checked out. Go to put stuff in my I get out to my car. I'm looking like, where are my roses? So I look at the receipt, no roses. I have no idea, like, could they have fallen out of my cart? Then I thought, oh my God, I have the wrong person's cart because I've done that. I made a little old Chinese lady very upset that I took her cart and it's all pre-COVID. So I don't know they fell out, those poor things just laying on the ground, but I wasn't going back in because, you know, anyway. That's what happened. I, I don't know what's my, where's going on in my brain. I just accept it's not firing on all cylinders. Okay, so I digress. Cards it says, may success and happiness follow wherever you go. Isn't that cute? And you know what? You could even do something here. You could do, hello, mini me. I love doing stuff like that. And the other one was, what's cooking? What's cooking? It's cooking. Trader Joe's is what's cooking. Trader Joe's. Okay, let's dish. So adorbs. And, okay, so it was just sitting out like this. Not in plastic, no envelope, just random. Just random. Because I would have gotten a couple. So I grabbed this from another one. Didn't you worry about the plastic and got it. Okay. I need to maybe send some cards out. All right. There was no new stuff that I was getting, really, because they have these wooden things that are really cute, like cutting boards, I guess. I think I got one as a gift downstairs. I gave one to my brother and his wife. Anyway, the only new thing they had was bite-sized sharp cheddar cheesy crackers. What's today? Today is Tuesday. I usually go Wednesdays. So I don't know if they were just not filled up or when new stuff comes out. I need me a friend that works at the Trader Joe's in Darnestown, Maryland. Yes, I do. Anyway, bite-sized sharp cheddar cheesy crackers. Um. You know, you can't go wrong with this. Some tomato soup. Um, or that really good. I did not buy any of the broccoli cheddar because I have two left. Because it's been so gross and hot. I know, it's like, it's just not normal. I, you don't need 70 degrees in November. It could have been 60s. It would be fine. I don't know. It puts me off my game. And I'm already way off. There's a little. Yummy. I could cheese it. But better packaging now. How cute. Made him a little flower. And you got your fox and your rabbit. You got your squirrel. You got your 
mouse pig, it looks like. Birdie. Anyway, a third of a cup is 130 calories. I love these things on um, salads. Add a little crunch and munch. Okay. I got this, the extra virgin olive oil. This is such a good deal. Um, do you guys want prices? Maybe I should. I don't know. I love how people do it on there. I'm going to learn one day to do it on my haul, but I'm just lucky to get these things up now. Um, let me see. I don't know. There's been a lot. It's not poking up at me here. I don't know. Did they charge me for it? You know they did. Hmm. Huh. Okay. I don't want to slow my flow, but... I don't see it on here. That's weird. Don't tell me that and I have to go back and pay for it. I don't know. Anyways, for my friend, I have it right now. I love it. It has a little thing in it. You just pour it. It's so cute. You can't beat, you cannot beat their olive oil. Mimi, I can't send it to you because it's just a pain in the butt to send. But you guys, go to Trader Joe's and load up on olive oil. It's the best deal in town. Butterscotch bit bars. These, you know, I will say... I still have one from last time. Too good. I have to eat them at my kitchen table and be mindful and enjoy it and not just sit somewhere when I'm watching TV and eat them. Turkey gravy. So I'm going to have this to go with because you never have enough gravy. Um, vanilla cake baking mix. Natural flavors. So good, you guys. Got one for my friend, Cindy and Minnie. Friend Michelle is trying to eat healthy. So I'm going to give that to my friend Beverly. And again, you doctor it up. You can make a chocolate cake, I think, or do all kinds of stuff. Um, it's made with Madagascar bourbon vanilla. But it, I don't know what that is, but this is so good. Yes, I, I'm loading up on this, you guys. Don't buy it in my store because I want it. Cranberry sauce. I got one for my friend Bev, one for my friend Angela, because I'm that kind of person. But you guys, woo, it's going on my gobbler and my quesadilla. Mm, mm, mm. And around Maryland, as it is around the world and the States, things are not going well. Numbers are rising. Um, one of my favorite people on YouTube called, um, I, can't, I get mixed up with her name, Keto Twisted Gypsy. Keto Twisted Gypsy or Twisted Keto Gypsy. My gypsy girl just did a thing about her COVID experience in the hospital and what a nightmare and scary and upsetting. And man, the girl is raw and I appreciate her sharing it because let me tell you something. This is real and she's lucky she's alive and she knows that. Um, so things are gonna start tightening up again, I feel. We just had our governor who, thank you goodness, He's a good governor and has really worked hard to keep us safe and also try to balance with the economy. But, you know, so he's stepping things back. If you're, let's see, if you are a state employee in Maryland, approved to telework, you have to telework starting tomorrow night. Um, he suggests other counties start doing that. What's funny is I'm in Montgomery County and they're being super conservative. They're doing a great job. Or like, and Dr. Gales are my hero. And um, Travis Hales, I think. I don't know. My brain. They're taking it slow, and they were in phase two. And Hogan was kind of hollering, like, you need, you need to go to phase three. And next thing you know, what, week, two weeks later, now big troubles. So good thing they didn't take his advice. So I don't know what's going to happen, but I'm going to be eating Trader Joe's O's during the revolution. If I had to get stuck saying, I'm going to have me some Trader Joe's. So I buy two every time I go. I think I have about ten. So y'all get stuck. You come over here and I'll give you some Trader Joe's O's. They're so good. Again, they're like adult SpaghettiOs. They're, um, I think, $1.99 each. Double what you can get at the Dollar Tree. Um, they do that at thing and then you don't know. Um, obviously, I pay for nothing. Jeez Louise. I should look at these things. The um, cranberry sauce is $1.99. For pure heaven. This is weird. I don't see it. Oh, the olive oil was $7.49. I'm sure it's on here. Because that does not make sense. Um, you guys. 
Anyway, I'm going to say they're $1.49. So they're 49 cents more expensive. I'm sure you can get them on sale, but they're worth it. They're just grown up SpaghettiOs. So I think y'all, I think y'all, this is it. I've been listening to Fanny Flag has a new sound recording and um, called The Wonder Boy of Whistle Stop. And it's a sequel to Fried Green Tomatoes. We'll stop cafe and she just says you know, she talks like this and she's so lovely you gotta listen to it you got to and it just i cried my heart out because she's such a storyteller and these are people you know or you wish you knew you know and this nostalgia and you know my mom when my mom my brother and i took her back to her hometown fertile minnesota <clears throat> to have her ashes buried there that's another story um but it made me you know, it's funny. My brother has always been very nostalgic because he was older than I. My, grand, my grandma died when I was seven. So um, I remember her and have amazing memories of her. But you know, he was older. He was like eight years older than me. So he had different memories and very nostalgic. But when we went back, he kind of felt done. And I just felt like I'd become a YouTube star. And I'm going to buy me a little house in fertile Minnesota because I felt so connected. And my niece and nephew did. It was a beautiful, beautiful thing. And um, so... <clears throat> In a time of complete nuts going on, listen to Fanny Flagg. I can tell you, all her books are so good, character driven and slow and lovely and her language and her accent. She reads it, y'all. She does a great job. And you know, y'all got to, you got to listen to it. I won't do my Minnesota accent. Oh no, I won't do that. Anyway, I'm just a frustrated actress, I think. But Fanny Flagg, listen to it because she reads it. It's amazing. You guys can get it online and put it at your local library. Get cards. Go on and get yourself a digital card throughout the United States and put it on hold and wait and listen to it. I'm a little bereft now because I just ended it and I listened to the last part again and I'll probably listen to it later again because these are people I like and want to spend time with. And she just brings everything so wonderfully to the conclusion. Okay, so that's it. That's me. That's what's happening right here, right now in my Trader Joe's world. My happy Trader Joe's. And y'all, I have found this um, radio station. I don't know what it is. Um, that's from my childhood, like my teen years, high school, college. And I am, I just heard Beast of Burden by the Rolling Stones. Some Girls has got to be one of my favorite songs of all time. I can remember playing it on my record player in my room, like dancing, pretending like Mick Jagger was there. I... 100% remember that. Oh my God, I played that over. That was just kind of, you know, a little risque for a 12 year old. But you know, back then it was a thing in the 70s, man. There was none of this PC kind of business going on. Whether we were better or worse, I don't know. Um, but yeah, so now I'm classic radio. I'll take it. It's just so much fun. Jay Giles Band just played Baby is a Centerfold, Angel is a Centerfold. So anyway, that's it. I could ramble on and on because you use all my favorites. So thank you for watching. I hope you comment. Let me know what you love. Let me know what I should be getting. Tell me to stop singing and I won't. So whatever. But anyway, you guys be safe. Be super safe. Don't have fatigue. No. Don't think, uh, okay. It's been going on. It's, no, it's not okay. It's just, it's not. It's probably more uh, not okay than it's been in a long time. Wear your mask correctly. I put tape because it fogs up my glasses. So I put some tape right here. So, because what's going out can come in. So I do that. It sucks. It's horrible. But I think if you watch, um, again, Keto Twisted Gypsy, you should go anyway and watch her. She's so much fun. And she does Trader Joe's, not Trader Joe's, Dollar Tree. And she's fun. She does it in her car. I just, I don't know. I love her. You know how you just see people and you just connect. But watch what she went through. <clears throat> that should give you pause. And it's not going to be me because um, there's nothing I need to do that, that's important, you know. So I hope you guys are safe. I love you. Each and every one of you, welcome to my family, people. I appreciate it. You're going to be my peoples now. You know, I say, tell me about your people. Okay, love you. See you soon. Bye.